Hi everyone, I'm Ahaz Dalal and welcome to another episode of Games That Inspire Me as a Game Director at Hazardation. And today I'm going to be playing this gorgeous game here called Poppin' Twimby by Konami. I'm going to be playing this with my Super Famicom. So let's, um, let's take a look at the game first. Poppin' Twimby by Konami. This is a very unique game in so many ways. It took the shoot 'em up genre and it just spun it on its head and flipped the genre to a point where it kind of coined its own genre by fans called Cute 'em Up. That's right, Cute 'em Up. And the reason why is if I just zoom in closer, you'll see to the artwork here. It's colorful. The spaceships are anthropomorphized type characters which have gloves and feet and you fly those little cutesy, curvy, bally type characters to shoot and are piloted by these cute anime characters. It just did everything that was the opposite of what you would see aesthetically and presentation wise to shoot, up, shoot em up. But it still had the same mechanics of a shoot em up game. And this is a vertical side scrolling shooter game as well. It was released in 93 in Japan and Europe in 94. But let's talk a little bit about what makes this game awesome. I think the thing about this was is it had that really whimsical, cartoony aesthetic. Like the colors and everything was like super cute, super cool, very bubblegum pop type colors. This is actually, this game inspired me a lot for the games that we're developing at the moment in order to try and push the aesthetic to, to make it much more colorful and bubblegum type. Um, this is a two player game. So there's two player mode on this cooperative player mode as well which is very very cool the games that we make at Hazmation we have a lot of co-op so we look at this game a lot for seeing how they push the cooperative shooters um, genre um, the power up was very interesting you would pick up these bells these floating bells which is kind of just kind of cute as well um, and even like the the firepower will be done in a very cute way as well. And you would have the traditional weapon upgrade and so on. Vibrant visuals, which was very, very cool. Had this very upbeat, catchy kind of soundtrack, which was not usually associated to shoot 'em ups. So it had a very light hearted tone to the game, which was awesome. The the balance and difficulty was very cool as well, because it, because it's cooperative shoot 'em up, it had a different kind of mechanic and difficulty balancing. The bubblegum color palette is phenomenal. I love it. Um, everything's got style. And I think that's a big takeaway for me from a, from a game designer's point of view. In terms of inspiration, this has got a lot of style. And that's something I'm going to take away from this game massively. And I'm afraid that's all we've got time for in this episode. But if you enjoyed the video and you enjoy the content on this channel, then please do hit the subscribe button. It would really help us and it would really inspire us to continue making more content for you on the Hazemation channel. In the meantime, please leave your comments and thoughts in the comments section about the video and also let us know what games you guys are playing what retro consoles you played when you were a kid or still are playing like i am today until next time see you on the next video